Hello everyone. Welcome to Solly Tutorials YouTube channel. In this video I'm going to show you 15 effects that are very popular and used. These effects are mostly used to look more attractive, next level, smooth, and to impress people. I will show you step by step how to use all the effects in this video. I will try to show you all these effects quickly and also help you save your valuable time. I request you friends, please like the video. And if new to my channel make sure you subscribe to the channel. So let's get started. 1. The first effect I will show you is the romantic overlay effects. Make your love, romantic and wedding couple scenes beautiful and attractive with romantic effect overlay. That's why you can call it romantic effect overlay. For this, drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Go to effects and click on it. Search within effects here romantic. When you search for romantic here, you will find many romantic effects here. From here I drag and drop the romantic love overlay 09 effect into the track above the timeline. Reduces the duration of the effect. On the second effect, romantic love overlay 02, I drag and drop this effect into the same track of the timeline. Also set its duration. I copy this video. I am pasting this video with the same video. And I apply one or two romantic effects on this video as well. The third effect that I drag and drop on top of the video is the Romantic Love Overlay 01 effect. Right click on the video. I go to speed. Click on reverse inside the speed and reverse the video. This effect I split here and delete this part of the effect. The fourth effect that I apply to the video is called the Romantic Love Overlay 06 effect. I have applied these few effects on this video, you can apply any other romantic effects of your choice in the same way. Let's see the preview of this romantic lovely overlays. Two. The second effect I show you is human segmentation effect. The human segmentation effect in film or as AI portrait allows you to isolate people from the background of a video without a green screen. All it takes is a few clicks. Once the background has been removed, you will see the main foreground of your video in real time. For this, I drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Split and delete the extra part of the video. Go to effects and click on it. Search for human segmentation effect here. Drag and drop this effect onto the effect on the timeline. So you can see that this effect removed the background of our video without the green screen. I drag and drop the video from this track to the track above. Go to media and click on it. Drag and drop the video to a background timeline from here. So I removed the background of this video and added a background video. Let's see the preview of this effect. Three. On number three, I will show you the magnify effect. A magnify effect is an effect that is used to produce a magnified image of an object. In the latest version of Wondershare Filmora, you can find the magnify effect under the effect tab. Let me show you. Drag and drop any video from media onto the timeline. Go to effects and search for magnify effect. Drag and drop this effect over the video on the timeline. If you want to adjust the settings of this magnifier effect, so double click on the video. Go to the effects section and click on it. From here you can adjust the radius of the magnify effect. Zoom rate. Center X. Center Y. Thickness. Alpha. And you can like the border color. Okay. Let me show you a preview of this magnify effect. Four. On number 4 I will show you the magic swing effect. This effect is similar to a mix, dissolve or disintegration effect. This effect is very easy to use and very cool to look at. Drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Go to the effects tab and click on it. Search here for magic swing effect. Drag and drop the effect over the video on the timeline. After applying the effect, let's see the preview of the effect. Three. 
5. At number 5 I will show you the neon swing effect. This neon swing effect is my favorite effect. It scans your body and does a transition logo animation in just one click. Let's move on to this effect. For this, drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Click on the effects tab and open it. Search for neon swing effect here. Apply this effect by dragging and dropping it over the video. You can see a preview of this effect. At number 6 I will show you end screen effects. An end screen, also referred to as an end card or end slate, is a YouTube feature that appears in the last 5 to 20 seconds of a video. YouTubers can use their end screen to promote videos, playlists, merchandise and external websites. For this, go to the effects tab and click on it. Search for the end screen effect here. For example, I drag and drop this effect on the timeline. This end screen effect is something like this. I delete the effect and find another end screen effect. Here you will find a lot of end screen effects. Here I drag and drop this end screen effect on the timeline. This end screen effect is something like this. Now I can put any video and logo of my channel in it. For that I go to media and click on it. I drag and drop this effect into the track above. I drag and drop the video into the bottom track of the timeline. Double click on a video to embed it within it. Go to transform tab and unfold it. From here scale down the video like this. And then bring the position of the video in the end screen something like this. You can also set the scale and position of the video from here. Okay. After that we also add the logo. Select both the effect and the video on the timeline and move it up a track by dragging and dropping it. Drag and drop the logo to the bottom track on the timeline. Double click on the logo. Unfold the transform tab. Adjusting the scale and position of the logo is the same as how we adjusted the scale and position of the video. Keep the effect, logo and duration of the video the same. Let me show you a preview of it. Seven. At number 7 I will show you the horizontal open effect. As you know a lot of the video industry seems to apply this effect quite often. Which is the famous effect. Let's know how to apply and use it. Drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Go to the effects tab and click on it. Search here horizontal open effect. Drag and drop the effect onto the video on the timeline. Let's see the preview of this effect. Oh, 08. At number 8 I will show you cinematic digital slideshows. Cinematic digital slideshows are great Filmora effects perfect to create cool looking parallax slideshow, intros, promos or presentations. Drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Go to the effects tab and click on it. Search here for cinematic digital slideshows. From here you can apply your favorite cinematic digital slideshows effects to your videos by dragging and dropping them. Which gives a very nice look. Here you will find many cinematic digital slideshows effects. Let me show you a preview of it. At number 9 I will show you streaming gaming championship overlay pack effect. The streaming gaming championship overlay pack effect, which simpler visuals and cleaner animation. Drag and drop the video on the timeline. Go to the effects tab and click on it. Search streaming gaming championship pack overlay O2 effect here. Drag and drop the effect of the video on the timeline and apply it. Let me show you a preview of this effect. 10. At number 10 I'll show you lighting overlays. The lighting overlay are filter effects that promise beautiful and smooth light effects to your video. For this, drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Go to the effects tab and click on it. Search here for lighting overlay overlay. When you search for it, you will see many lighting overlay effects.
To apply these effects, drag and drop the effect onto the track above the timeline. From here I drag and drop some of the lighting overlay overlay effects into the track above the timeline. You can see the preview of these effects. Eleven. The effect I'm going to show you at number eleven is the audio visualizer effects, especially fit for podcast and music video. Take your podcast and music video to the next level by enhancing them through audio visualizing effects. Go to effects and click on it. Search here for audio visualizer. Up to 25 audio visualizer effects to choose. Filmora offers up to 25 types of audio visualizing effects, which you can customize to better match. From here, you can drag and drop any visualizer effect of your choice onto the timeline. I drag and drop the modern audio visualizer effect onto the timeline. You need an audio for this visualizer effect. I open by clicking on the audio tab. From here, I drag and drop an audio onto the timeline. When you drag and drop, Filmora will automatically add the audio visualizing effect to match the sound in your video. You can set the duration of the effect in this way. You can see a preview of this audio visualizer effect. Twelve. On number twelve, I will show you travel overlay effects. We are back with these travel overlay effects, designed to make your video more attractive and effective. To create this travel overlay video, go to the Effects tab and click on it. Search here travel. After doing this search, many travel overlay effects will be loaded here. I have already downloaded some of these effects. I go to the download section. Search here for travel. Here are the downloaded effects. Of these, I drag and drop the travel scrapbook overall O3 effect onto the timeline. Go to media. Below this track, I drag and drop the video. Double click the video and adjust it behind the overlay. Go to the transform tab and unfold it. Adjust the scale, rotation, and position of the video from here. Okay. Move the effect up one more track by dragging and dropping it. In the middle track on the timeline, I drag and drop another video. Select the video and click on the crop tool. Cut this video in one-to-one -one ratio. Double click on the video. Unfold the transform tab. Adjust this video in the second box of the overlay like the previous video here. Equalize the duration of both videos and effects. I go back to the effect. From here, drag and drop another travel overlay effect onto the timeline. The name of this effect is Travel Memories Overlay 2. I also drag and drop a video onto the timeline in the background of this effect. Double click on the video. Also adjust this video scale, rotation and position etc. as before. Okay. Delete the extra part of the video. Now we will add a transition between the two travel overlay effects. Go to transitions and click on it. Search for flash transitions here under transitions. Drag and drop this effect between the two travel overlays effects. After doing all that, let's see a preview of it. Thirteen. On number thirteen, I will show you smoke effect overlays. Try to make a big action scene with these smoke effect overlay effects. These wisps and large pillars of smoke are exactly what you need. 
For this, I have already dragged the video onto the timeline. Go to the effects tab and click on it. Search for smoke effect overlay here. After doing this search, here you can see many smoke effect overlays. For example, I drag and drop this smoke effect overlay onto this video on the timeline. Or if you want to apply multiple smoke effects to a video at once. So delete this effect. And split the video into parts like this. And drag and drop the smoke effect overlay on top of each clip separately. After applying smoke effect overlays, let me show you a preview of it. Fourteen. On number 14 I will show you the round opener effect. In this video we will be learning at round opener or circle wipe transition effect in a very simple way. To add this round opener transition effect, drag and drop the video onto the timeline. Go to effects and click on it. Search for the round opener effect here. Apply this effect by dragging and dropping it over the video. After applying you can see a preview of the effect. Fifteen. On number 15 I will show you the negative dark effect. The negative dark effect that I will show you today is the simplest perfect effect. To apply this effect, drag and drop any video from the media onto the timeline. Go to effects and click on here under effects search negative dark. Drag and drop the effect onto the video on the timeline. Let's see the preview of this effect. 16. To say thank you for all Filmora and Filmstock users, Filmstock will be giving away a 1-year Filmstock standard plan license to 10 lucky participants. Check the link in description for a chance to claim the prizes and never miss giveaways. To say thank you to all of you, we will be giving away a Filmstock standard plan license worth over $100 to 10 lucky participants. How can you Hope you like these 15 effects a lot. And you will benefit from it by using it in your videos. Let me know which of these effects you liked in the comments. Please like this video if this video helped you. Subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to stay with us. See you soon. Bye.